Hey guys, I'm here to do another Christmas tutorial, or even New Year's really. Um, yeah, so this one's more of like a wearable version because uh, I recorded the other one the night before last and I just looked at it again I was like, yeah, that was kind of dark. So, and I was sitting here, I was like, you know, I'm already ready. I just got ready to go to Walmart, so why not record another tutorial? So I came up with this. Um, it's just like a gold shimmery eye and then like a creamy red lip. I think it's really pretty. So let's get on right onto this tutorial and yeah, I don't know. <laughs> All right, so I just have my Tarte uh, eye primer, the lifted eye primer on and my brows done. And I don't have my foundation on since this has like some shimmer that will fall out and stuff. Now, um, the first color I'm gonna take is Chase from the Urban K 15th Anniversary Palette. This is like a medium gold color, it's right there in like in the outer third. Not in the crease, but kind of in the crease. You'll see the color. I'm just gonna take a fluffy blending brush, and I'm just gonna pat this on the outer portion, and just blend this over, and then, this is a really shimmery color. And then kind of put it in the crease just a tiny bit. And go about like halfway with that on the lid like that. And now I'm going to take Vanilla out of the same palette. And this is like a shimmery pale yellow right there. Same brush. And then just put that on the rest. Oh, it's in my eye. And then just blend it over and blend where they meet, like that. And then I'm gonna take uh, Midnight 15. It's just a pale champagne-ish glittery color up here. I'm gonna put that with the same brush. <laughs> I'm gonna put that on the inner corner and then blend it up so it's really highlighted there. And then right underneath the brow, just a tiny bit. You don't want it to be too, too shimmery up Then there. just with the pencil brush, I'm gonna take Max Espresso. I think I just dug my nail in an eyeshadow. Just this medium brown right there, and it's a matte. Just on a pencil brush, and I'm gonna go right about the crease with this. And then um, out here. And then blend it up with the same brush. You don't wanna flip it back to that blending brush unless you wipe it all the color off with like a brush cleanser. Otherwise, you're going to get glitter up here, and that's not what we want. So like that, you just want it to be like a light shadow there. You don't want it to be a full-on brown. And then I'm going to take the pencil brush again, and wherever I put it, and I'm going to take Werewolf out of the Tarte palette. It's like a dark matte chocolate brown. I pick it up, but it's huge. It's just a darker color than Espresso. And I'm just going to pet that on the outer V portion. And then I'm going to take a small smudger brush and take Werewolf again and put this on the lower lash line like that. And then the blending brush again and take Midnight 15. You could take a smaller brush and then just bring Midnight 15. So I'm going to tie line with the Tarte uh, Emphasize Gel Eyeliner just on the uh, top waterline. And then I'm gonna take the same one and take just a small angle brush and just do a slight wing with that. I'm gonna apply the Tarte uh, Lights Camera Lashes Mascara because I never really tried it, so I really like it actually. And I'm gonna do my foundation and then tell you what I put on my cheeks and my lips. I forgot to say for the highlight, I know we put the Midnight 15 there, but that's just too, I guess it's not too bad. But I'm just going to take a fluffy brush, and I'm going to take a matte white, uh, which is Gesso by MAC. And then out of the True Blood palette, well, first off, here's Werewolf, that chocolate brown. Now I'm going to take, I think, is Dusk. Uh, yeah, Dusk. It's just a skin matte skin tone shade. Uh, I'm taking the white, so because it's kind of like a pinkier skin tone shade. Tapping that off, and then just putting this on top of Midnight 15. That way the Midnight 15 still shines through but it's not just like all glitter up here. Like that. So now I'm gonna go finish off with the mascara and everything. Alright so I'm done with everything. Um, 
I just did my, just did my normal foundation. I don't know what that was. <laughs> um, Alright, so I wanted, like, highlighting wise, I wanted it to be pretty prominent because, you know, it's a party and everything. And since these, the, the these is. <laughs> Since th these are really shimmery, it's like, okay, well, I'm gonna double that up with the highlighter. So, uh, heavily I applied the MAC Marlite Skin Finish in Light Scapade. It's just like a pale, like my other holiday video, it's just like a pale champagne ish color with um, veins of different colors in it. It's so pretty. And then, um, for bronzer, I just used my bronzer that I use all the time. It's the Herbal Mosaic Powder from Palladio, and I never say this shade, but it's in Sunkissed. I also use that to contour in my nose. I contoured my highlighting wise, uh, cheekbones, and I kind of went down here a little bit. Uh, and then ch cheekbones, nose, chin, lip, and then forehead, which you can't even see anyway. And then I contoured my nose, and then, um, oh, and underneath too with the bronzer bronzers underneath the cheekbones, temples. I kept it really far back on the temples, like <laughs> I was pretty much doing my hair because I didn't want it to be like really close to any, you know what I mean? Uh, and then for blush, I used Cargo's The Big Easy. It's just a really pretty shimmery peach blush. Not like glitter shimmery, but like satiny, shim like sheen kind of. And then for my lips, um, since everything else was pretty glittery and sh like, shimmery and stuff. The light, the mineralized skin finish is more of like a natural glow, so that's why I applied that heavily, just so it was more glowy. And then I didn't really set my foundation except for my concealer underneath my eyes, just to, because I didn't want it to be matte, you know what I mean? Like, you know, yeah, you, you get what I'm saying. And then for my lips, I wanted to, uh, since every, like I said, since everything was shimmery, uh, I wanted to keep this like, not matte necessarily, but just like creamy. So I used NYX's Red Hot Lip Liner. This is like a bright red lip liner. Filled that all the way in and then I uh, applied Max Lip Glass in Viva Glam Cindy Sydney. Oops. Sydney. Which is just a creamy like uh, kind of like pinkish red in a little bit. It's really pretty. So with that said, I'm done. I hope you guys have a great Christmas or holiday, whatever, which one you celebrate. And yeah, so check the blog post link for pictures and a products list. And I'll see you guys later, maybe next year even. I don't know, this year went by fast. So if not, I, if I don't make a New Year's video or something, I'll see you guys later. I don't know why I froze and didn't say bye, so bye!